Hi everybody, it's Robin. As you guys know, we have a, an extra child uh, living with us for the remainder of the school year because his parents had to move and he didn't want to miss out on his college prep classes. So I asked him the other night if there was something in particular that his mom makes that he's missing and he said really um, the only thing is a Cuban sandwich. So never made one but looked it up so I made up some pulled pork. Look at those. This is a bone and shoulder. You could do boneless if you want to. I had a rub on it of salt and pepper and chili powder, a little bit of cayenne, onion and garlic powder, some cumin, some paprika, some brown sugar, and um, if you let the rub sit overnight it's super good. If not, you know, just rub it and put it in. And then I put it in a roasting pan. I put them together. I keep them uncovered and I put my meat thermometer in and I pull it out when it's at 165 degrees and then I move it to this cutting board and let it rest um, until it's cool enough for me to pull apart. Um, what else was I going to say about that? Oh, I started off at 350 and then I turn it down to like 325 and these two took maybe about four hours so I'm also going to pair that. So Cuban is ciabatta, or, well it's bread, I'm using ciabatta and that has pulled pork, some deli ham, spicy mustard, pickles, and Swiss cheese, and then you grill it kind of like a grilled cheese. So I'll show you that process later. My parents are coming over for supper, and I asked for suggestions what to pair it with, and someone said a sweet and spicy coleslaw. So that's what I'm going to do. I like to buy mine already done up. That just saves me a lot of time, but feel free to shred up carrots and cabbage if you want to. I have two, and I'm doubling my recipe because we have a lot of people. I have two Granny Smith apples. I have some sugar and some um, apple cider vinegar. That's some cayenne, some salt and pepper, mustard, and mayo. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to, going to thinly slice my apples. I'm going to get my ingredients mixed up and then we'll pour it over the coleslaw. I like to double this mixture just because I don't know how wet I want it. And if you don't know, coleslaw will um, seep out more moisture the more it sits. Okay, so I'll be right back. And my apples, I just did long thin slices. You can chop them, do whatever you want to. I mixed up the dressing and I will start with maybe half of it for now. I'll give it a toss and then we'll see what that looks like. All mixed up. I tasted it and I added a little more cayenne because I didn't put in a whole lot to begin with. I think it's plenty sweet right now but I'm going to let it sit for a couple of hours in the fridge and let the flavors marry and then I'll give it a stir and a taste again and see if I want to adjust anything else. Everybody getting ready to um, assemble the Cubans. So we have our pulled pork and then there's going to be ham, Swiss cheese, pickles, um, I have different kinds of mustards and then I'm going to butter the ciabatta bread. Okay so before I start grilling I will show you one put together. So I've got some made so we have some pork, some ham, Swiss cheese. I put Swiss cheese on the top and the bottom to hold it kind of like glue. The pickles, the mustard, and I bottom the bottom part of the bread. Now I'm just going to use the weight. Weight it down and once it's almost ready then I'll take the weight off and I will butter the top and flip them over. Dad, you want to be on camera? Nope. Mom, what? you want to be on camera? Oh, she's trying to run over here people. She wants to be on camera. <laughs> Only my wife would. Say hi, Mom. Hello, my fans out there. <laughs> I feel like I know you. <laughs> I feel like I know you. Are you excited you. to try dinner? Excited. All right. A little nervous about the uh, pickles and the mustard. Pickles and the mustard. But we're going to try traditional, traditional, the first sandwich, and then you can always yeah, and then I do can whatever you it. want on it. Yeah. All right. I taught you well. Oh, okay. <laughs> Say see you soon. See you soon. Love you all. This is what it looks like, folks. Hi, Dad. Hi, Dad. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Dad's keeping his separate. Mom's, I cut it open so you can kind of see what it looks like. And then she did a little um, bowl of slaw for hers. So I'm going to get working on the rest of them. Let me know if you thank try you. it and if you like it. And um, I'll talk to you next time. And thank you. If it was one of you in TV land that... And blog land.
<laughs> no, it was um, Matt. Remember, his mom makes these, and he was missing them. No, 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 for the slaw. No, that was Facebook. Someone said, make a sweet, slicey, slicey, yeah. <laughs> spicy slaw. Okay, we're cutting out now. <laughs> <laughs> make, your, make your slaw sweet and tangy. Yeah. All right. Say bye, folks. Bye.